afternoon, more Medic One. Today I have a uh, Kohler engine uh, that I'm going to be rebuilding. I uh, may not be able to make the video on it, but I'm going to try. But uh, this is a perfect candidate to show my viewers what uh, the basic function of a four cycle engine. Right here is the flywheel, and it spins and creates the energy needed to keep the engine spinning through the its uh, its cycles. Right now, the piston is at top dead center. As you can see, I can rock it back and forth, and the valves are at the point of overlap. Right there, both valves are actually open. Basically, when the engine starts down the piston, the intake valve opens. This is your carburetor. This is your intake. Uh, low pressure from the atmosphere forces the air through the carburetor and it atom atomizes the fuel and the engine pulls it in and down into your cylinder. And as the piston starts back up, it's called the compression stroke. And right about 10 degrees before top dead center, the spark plug fires. And when that fires, it forces the starts forcing the piston back down because of the explosion. When the piston gets to bottom dead center, about another 10 degrees before bottom dead center, the exhaust valves opens. And as the piston comes up, it forces the exhaust out the exhaust valve and out the muffler. And then the whole process is, process is repeated again. Right there is your valve overlap. Try to do it fast so you can see it. That's your basic function of a four cycle engine. Uh, lawn mowers, automobile, uh, rotary engines are a little different, but uh, anything with a piston engine with valves intake compression power exhaust if you have any questions about these little engines let me know more medic one y'all have a good day